The afterlife is comes into the midst of this reality uh, as a promise that all of this is going to make sense in the end, that somehow at the end of existence we are going to be all let in on the, the punchline and have a, a, a mighty laugh with Almighty God for eternity. Now, there's no evidence of that, and I, and I think, therefore, the, the, this concept of the afterlife really functions as a, as a substitute for wisdom. It, it functions as a substitute for, for really absorbing our predicament, which is that everyone is going to die. There are circumstances that are just catastrophically unfair. Evil sometimes wins, and injustice sometimes wins. Uh, and the only justice we're going to find in the world is the, is the justice we make. And I think we, need, we have an ethical responsibility to, to absorb this really down to the soles of our feet. And, and this notion of an afterlife, that the happy talk about how it's all going to work out and it's all part of God's plan, is, is a way of shirking that responsibility.